So my Arbor Vita is a beautiful bush, but the whole backside of it is being wiped out by these worms and cocoons. Oh my goodness. These caterpillars are completely wiping out my Arbor Vita. They're in cocoons and they are completely sucking the life out of my out of my tree. Oh yeah, you can actually see the little caterpillar down in this one right here. You can see his head. Where? Right here. Let's see if I can focus. Can you see his head right there? Oh, he just went down in there, but he'll be back out. Completely wiping out my plant. grub on there right there are you seeing this little worm thing completely eating my Arbor Vita. I cut my Arbor Vitas down so that they wouldn't infect other nearby plants. So when these things, when these worms lose their home, they, they're on the move trying to find another place. This one was moving pretty fast down this, down this branch. So it's like a caterpillar carrying its house on its back, kind of, I guess, kind of in a way resembling a hermit crab. That's pretty cool. Never would have guessed it. I was hoping that by cutting these trees down, I would shut them down and short circuit their development so that they wouldn't spread elsewhere. This guy's on the move. That is probably what drew the birds because these things are probably crawling across the across the, uh, the pavement, and they see them crawling across the pavement. Cray cray. <laughs> I think the birds were eating the worms out of these cocoons earlier. You can see the remainders of these things all over the place. Probably these were crawling around, and that's probably what, what drew the birds to the party.